2024, the wonderful month and the wonderful year designed and blessed by Elohim Chikokika Biyama Primi The one that all powers belongs to, Ikeli We are here once again today to lecture our people. Because if we stop doing so, enemies will continue to fool those they want to fool. 
I'm here today to discuss about important issue for the good and the development of our land. What I am here to do today is not what I should be doing at this point in time. But one thing has continued in the life of a black man. Black man needs constant reminder and constant lecturing. Without engaging in constant lecturing in the midst of black race, they always quickly to forgot where in started to beat doors. That is one thing about us. And it's part of our nature. And we can't do anything about it. Why we know all these things? Because we have the privilege, the grace, to live outside the black mist. Because what he taught a white man today, come back in the next 40 years time. As soon as he open mouth, to remind him that topic, he will tell you everything he have taught for 40, 40 years ago. That's how God made them. He will tell you, oh, stop, stop. I know what you're okay, okay, so 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 did. He will begin to remind you of that particular teaching. Today, that is why they have shifted in their, even in their Christianity life. That is why the white people, if you go to their church, they sing praises, they sing worship unto the Lord. then preach about love, caring, then go. If you ask them, why can't you go deeper into the Bible, they say oh, they have no all. There's nothing new there. But since I am born, at this age of my life, our pastors are still teaching Bible, reading Bible, because of our mindset, of our mentality. Our mentality is too damaged. If they don't continue to remind us or remind those, their followers, what is written there, they will not remember. That is why most of them, everything mass and the cannot talk on Radio Biafra for many years. Most of them don't even know. Even though, even the people that are listening, they can they can't even drive, they could not even accumulate knowledge from what Mazen Nandekan have taught so ever. This is why I love this man back home on ground, evangelist, I, 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 uh, fearless hip hop evangelist. I am not praising him. Many people have called me and said, Why are you among all the media? Why are you discriminating? I say, If you call it discrimination, that is your own problem. This is not discrimination. Because among all the people that listen to Radio Biafra, when Mazen and Kano were with us, I pop, sorry, I'm coming. Let me plug this thing so that you will not. Because I'm a truthful person. I said, I pop evangelist is the only man I see that went deep into that lecture. I think uh, what, I'm, what I've been finding out recently, I, I think why others are on media shouting your mama, your papa, insulting themselves on media because, you know, it happened when we were in school. During the lecture, there are people who come to acquire knowledge in school. 
There are people who come to smoke cigarettes in school. There are people who come to smoke weed in school. There are people who come to chase women in school. So that time, as in the kind was preaching on Radio Biafra, I discovered that there are some IPOB member who were interested in his voice only. Maybe as he's teaching, they are drinking beer. Maybe most of them himself were listening to Mazin and the Khan right from Biapalo. Imagine somebody who is drinking alcohol listening to Mazin and the Khan on Radio Biafra. What do you think that, that person will? <laughs> what do you think that person will remember later? That's why most of them fool themselves and fall into the trap of Nigeria recruited uh, agents. Let me say this is the last time I'm going to remind their friends globally about what is called agent provocateur. This thing is very simple for every knowledgeable man to understand the game. Imagine a man of 50 years, 60 years, 60 something years, 40 years, 30 years, 25 years. Ordinary sign, ordinary activity to detect who is the enemy of this land and who is the lover of this land. A man, a matured man of a black race could not understand simple body language. It's unfortunate. Very, very obvious. It is a pity. Okay, now let me tell you the IPOB oh, oh, manifesto. Let me go to IPOB manifesto. IPOB manifesto is, is there written very boldly. Protect every Biafrans. They did not say protect those who agreed. IPOB did not say protect those who agreed on IPOB ideology of quest for our freedom. What is written there is protect every Biafran. What is written in IPOB manifesto? Protect every Biafran. Because they have gone through a lot in Nigeria. The one that did not agree in our ideology today when Nigeria happened to him or her, the fellow will come back and join us. Oh, he cannot does not agree. He's against the Afra. No. He cannot at that moment have never realized the benefit of original identity. He can at that moment have not realized the benefit and the security in ownership. He can at that time have not realized the security behind being a bona fide citizen of a place. That is why he can may not have men may have not agreed on come let us have our nation but to be rest assured that one day he cannot will wake up something will happen to he he will turn back maybe the fe the fellow he will see is a tsunami at his back or the fellow he will see at his back is a Yoruba. The next thing that will happen to him, he will say, my brother, come I'm not your brother. <laughs> are, are you understanding me now? As he shout, my brother, help me. They say, no, we are not your brother. Go and call your brother. 
then the semi kenna will remember that lion man has been telling him about come let us unite together do you know what he can now do after that incident he can now begin to search for lion man hey, where is my that time he will remember that i'm on his brother and i am his brother oh yeah can do you do it you see when you wake up from sleep, that is when you should greet good morning. In abroad, there are people who wake up by 1 a.m. In abroad, there are people who wake up by 5 a.m. And if they have partner, or if that person is married, when he wake up, a man who wake up by 1 a.m. will greet his wife or the wife who, or the woman that wake up at that time will greet his husband. Oh, good morning, darling. Or the, the husband that wake up that time will say, good morning, honey. That is his own morning, 1 a.m. early in the morning. Of course, it's morning. Remember also, the one that wake up by 5 a.m. in the morning will also greet his partner in the house. Good morning. Remember also the one that wake up by 11 a.m. When some people are coming back from work, <laughs> we also greet his partner in his house. Good morning. Even the one that wake up uh, by 1 by one. One afternoon, one p.m. As far as he's inside the house, he will wake up. He, anybody available in the house is good morning. Maybe the person may now look his wristwatch and say, "Ah, you are just waking up now and greeting good morning. This is not morning. This is afternoon. Is that is it not I wake up? That is that fellow. Good morning. Is a parable. I am just speaking in a parable. So there is no cause for alarm." Do you know why I'm, I'm, I'm laying this foundation? I'm laying this foundation because I understand strategy of what is called agent provocateur. And who is champion? We have to, is this time we, we hit the nail by the head. No time to be wasting, beating around the bush. The people who is championing this killing action in Biafra land are majority. This is not a time to say why. Why is this political party? But it's unfortunate. Not every members of APC underline me, but majority of people who is championing this killing, according to how. The mission was handed over to them to frustrate our people, to make our people to give up in Biafra agitation. Is majority APC members in the eastern region? Is majority APC members? Ojo Zocaro is in the number one list. Who opposed are them at two? Oh, Enugu State Governor. That is what he promised them before he entered. As Enugu State Governor entered, he did not start considering. He did not start considering because he had gotten what he wanted. He now start considering of leaving that agenda. And uh, who did they mandated to be taking responsibility of all this atrocity? Their son. The Fulani give them their son in Finland. 
to take care of the responsibility of let me tell you something all the all the police officers that have been killed in the southeast i have said this thing lately last year i've said this thing earlier this year most of you have forgot that's why i come back again to remind all of you because most of you will say what is holding Mazin and the what is Nigeria holding Mazin and the Kano for? My friend, these are the reasons why Mazin and the Kano are still in detention, in illegal detention, innocently. These are the reasons. These are the major reasons. Mazin and the Kano has no crime he committed anywhere found in the law. Go and make your research. This is the same man who was locked up 2015. Pressure was mounted. The way pressure had mounted this time, he was released. Because that time Nigeria was not prepared to implicate him. Are you following the lecture? That time Nigeria was not prepared. But this time around, they get prepared by the directive of United Kingdom, by British government directive. They were they they got British government officials were experts in something they call agent provocateur. They have it, they, they form this thing, almost all the countries they want to destabilize. Any place they want to destabilize, they will form agent provocateurs. Years back, when we say that the, spon the major sponsors of terrorism around the globe is European countries. Many people do not agree. They say, is it not the same Europa that is fighting against terrorism, that preach terrorism in CNN, in Al Jazeera, in France 24 hours news? In the, I said, no. Forget about what you see on media. They have their agent who sponsor all these things many people did not agree when i said in 2007 i said i know how all these things functions it's just like when we were trained in nigeria army when we are trained i was uh, uh, fortunately i was among those they wanted to use for experts for some certain missions. You know, in army, they have some experts in certain missions. Not every army officers you see in Nigeria that go through army that wear uniform that move around of you no. Know, there are people experts. They use them for each administration use them for dangerous missions and their life. Their life is not guaranteed because one, if they help this general during the time of their military uh, 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 this thing, administration, if they use this particular, if they use you for some certain dangerous mission, if another person take over, he may start searching for you so that he will eliminate those ones and build his own. Because if you leave those ones, he may be thinking that those ones will one day rise above him and his government will collapse. That's one thing about this special mission, after this special squad. So we know how these things work.
and these special missionaries they scattered all over the world you leave you have to leave when you feel that you are not secure you leave you depart you leave go to the country of your choice go and stay and live your life quietly there Now let us come to discussion, reality about Biafra agitation. I am not angry. Uh, I am not totally blaming those that said the Finland son in Finland is an Igbo or is a, is a Biafran who is agitating and uh, asking for freedom of Mazin and the Kani. I am not angry with those who have that, still have that mindset or who have that thought in them. That is the level of their knowledge. It takes a wise man and a trained person to understand that the truth between his claim. Do you know why I brought this thing back again? I brought it back again because of the four officers and the POS girl in Imo State that was murdered, that was murdered last month. Yeah, we are the new month. So happy new month, everybody. So I will describe, I will say it is last month, yes. The POS girl that was murdered along the side of uh, Four police officers in Imo State that he came out to claim the responsibility water water that they have they are that they will keep on slaughtering them because I make a research of some certain things recently those people following him with Igbo name because if you watch what their what their Facebook always showcase, either Biafra, 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 Biafra go, Biafra go go, or you see Biafra must stay, or you see such as name as uh, Ugo Ugo Biafra, or you see uh, uh, Fred Biafra. You no, know, that kind of name. That is what. That is how you will know them. They would just everything they answer, Biafra was attached to it. Everything they answer, Biafra was attached to it. Go and check their Facebook. Then they will now put Mazen and the Kano picture, attach it with his own picture. Recently, I did something funny. I opened a strange Facebook. Unrecognized Facebook. I added one of them. I begin to send message on inbox in the form of I want to support. I am supporting them, but they never know that is me. I open a funny Facebook. I begin to call them on Messenger. I call up to four people on, on messenger they are not picking then the, the other one i called picked when he pick ugochi biafra i i i call i call the you know, i call the messenger unfortunately the person pick I go straight to the Igbo language. I speak Igbo. The next thing I hear, Assalamu alaikum. <laughs> Jesus Christ. The next thing I hear, Assalamu alaikum. I say, Assalamu alaikum. I answer the person as Assalamu alaikum. I speak Igbo again. 
，你不是，这开啊，你你不是开啊啊啊 ！I don't speak, I don't understand him. I call the God. <laughs> I I laugh. I laugh. I say, when I am telling people that these people they are not majority of them they are not. The only few bona fide Biafrans that are following this guy are the only the criminals. Only the criminals, those who have, you know, we have already, we can, this is undisputable, we cannot dispute it. In Biafra land, we have had criminals. Who we are committing crime in Lagos, committing crime in Abuja, committing crime. So that is only people. There is no person with his real mindset and knowledge of Biafrans that is in support of this guy. Because then every knowledgeable, a bona fide Biafra son and daughter knows the game he's playing. The, I said this is the right time I will lecture Biafra about this thing. And you know why I'm saying this thing? So that Alloy the Jimako and the siblings of Mazen and the Kano will hear me. People, I have done my investigation. Not 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 the first time, not the second time, not the third time. What is holding Mazen and the Kano today? The international world understand what is holding Mazen and the Kano. And let me take, let me say it openly. Mazen and the Kano will never, never come outside. They will not. The Mazen and the Kano, God forbid, they may die there. On one, he may die there on one condition. Go and write this word today. Today is first of August. I wanted to ignore everything because what we are looking at is Biafra. But I have looked at. I said no. If Mazin and the car no come out as alive, we will get Biafra. If he die there, we will get Biafra. Biafra is not what we must get as far as this IPOB is concerned. Either he is available, he is not available, Biafra will even when he is, when he die there, Biafra will come so fast. Go and mark it somewhere. He will come as speedy as anything. He will be surprised to everybody. So IPOB have this energy. Why are they waiting all this while? But I have looked at it and said, no. The prayer of every parent is, I want to eat the fruit of my labor. I want to enjoy the fruit of my labor. I am a father. Imagine me laboring for my daughter. I have no much ch children. The children I am training, I have over, let's say over 10 children I'm training. But the one is my own child is one. I decided to do so. Imagine me, that my daughter and I am investing to. Now I go. You become what you want to become tomorrow. Then another person will be the one eating the benefit, seeing the benefit. Not that I am not waiting for a child to feed me, no. But to see it is a joy. What I'm saying is, I want this man to come out and enjoy the. I keep on telling all of you. 
Mazen Nandekano have nothing to offer us again. He have done his own perfect job. IPOB does not need him to offer anything again. Hear it now, hear it into your score. IPOB is due to restore Biafra. They have, Mazen Nandekano have finished his own job. His own job is over and over. Hear me and hear me like, it's over. For most of you, we were waiting, maybe, maybe you, maybe you are thinking that IPOB is waiting for him to come and say that we will restore Biafra. No. We are waiting for him to come out alive so that he will come and enjoy Biafra that we are going to restore. His own job is to finish. We don't need him again. Why I'm saying this thing because of the stupid one who is falling on this trap of agent provocateur. They never knew that they are contributing to the incarceration of Mazen Nandekan. That's what I'm what this is what I mean. They all know that they are part and parcel ignorant, you know, most of although most of people are ignorant. Although Martin Asa would have said this in already Biafra, anybody who say that he doesn't know the activities of this guy is a lie, is lying. Let's say from the beginning, many people were confused. People who are sincere to themselves now recover themselves and come back. Good. Then people who are in IPO out of shame, most of them walk away. They say, ah, ah, in which eyes will I go to now and meet my coordinator? And tell them I am back to IPO. You know, most of them from there they walk away. I know many of them who just quietly walk away. And uh, there is one of them I have talked to. I say, You have sacrificed a lot for IPOB. Do away with shame. Come and apologize. We welcome you. I know you are not happy again. I told him because the guy you know is not feeling happy anymore. I said, I know you are not happy again because somebody fooled you. Forget about. Come with the spirit of humility. You will be back again. I said, I will sure that you are back again. Yes, uh, in Kiru, we must be sincere. This is not a time of emotion. If Mazen and the Kano and the siblings of Mazen and the Kano did not come out openly, this is what many world leaders are waiting for. If they don't come out openly eh, and condemn the activities of this guy in Finland, Mazen and the Kano will not come out. Go and write it somewhere. If Mazen and the Canada does not come out and, and, you know, before I was among the people that said Mazen and the Canada does not need to come to court and said anything regarding this boy. But it is necessary now. You know, I speak with the intel. I don't just speak anyhow. I speak with a solid intel. If Mazen and the Kano did not come out openly, or if uh, what do you call it, Aloy de Jimako, did not come, although there are something that, that tangled them together, that entangled them together. But it has come to the point where that thing that tangled them together, they have to break it, and all of them will face the shame. Man, if Alor Ejimako come out and did the way and do the way Barista Ifa Jofo did by this by distancing Mazin and the Kano from a eh? If he did not come out and do that the same thing, Mazin and the Kano is not coming out. I remember he's a human being, he's not healthy is not that healthy there he may give up if you give up biafra will come the only thing that i wish i say well i said it maybe that is how himself wanted it 
I know, I know which I will never ever, ever open my mouth and say, I know what angled, I know the what is what silencing the mount of siblings of Mars and Nandika. I know where the spirit of silence come from because they are committed. This guy know most of the secret and they were involved. So any pakam that phone and the boy that bastard we we open everything on media, everybody will be on the run. He will open it. You know how they open ant? He will just open the ant like on like this zoom. This is what they are afraid for. But if they want to be afraid of such condition and they lose a man of such caliber over to them. Over to them. Over to them. This is not something to say on media. I can never say it to anybody. No two air will hear it. This is something that's why I say to myself when Martin Nandekano comes out outside, I can only wait to hear when IBB will call say Oga. We need to ask you a question. If everywhere is silent, I wait one month after one month. No action is taken by any IPOB worldwide. No IPOB family member come on here to say, Sir, come, we need to have a meeting with you. We need to ask you some questions. Nobody is above, no leader is above questioning. If I didn't hear it, I lie on man, we come out and say, and ask him, or oh, God, come outside. Since the others don't want to ask you questions, I have a question to ask you. This is why Prince Dalentin did the video he did because of what I said on my, one of my programs. But that shows that most of them does not know what the meaning of freedom is. I, don't, I am not here to serve any man. I am here to serve for Biafra restoration purpose, period. I am not here to serve any single human being. If I need service of a man, then I will ask to pay me salary. Yes. Then I can answer yes, sir, anywhere, any corner I want. Then I will request that all the internet data that I have born for over how many years, since 2016 till now, how many years is that? Getting to 10 years. I will, I will request, I have, the, I have my payment sleep here for my internet. And those of you that knows me since that time till now, I have never signed out of internet one day. You know what, you know how much is that? It will run into a millions of dollars. He will give me the money. Then I can answer, sir. Then I know that I did not come for purpose of Biafra. I come for service of a man. Yes. You know, most of you don't know that data, you don't know that internet is very expensive. <laughs> because most of you come to internet. <laughs> most of you come to internet once in a while. Maybe two times in a week. You know. We stay in Italy 24-7. Go and go and monitor from tonight. Go and monitor if you can monitor it. If you, do you have the capacity to monitor my internet? 24-7 since 2016 to date. 24-7. You don't know what they call 24-7. You know they blink. 247. Because I leave it like that because of anybody who want to get me any moment they want any minute they want to pass information they can get me and pass the information so that things will not go wrong do you know what i said all the killing that is killing 
they will kill, they will come out and the parade, they said it's Liberation Army. They have killed, they know. They are not, Liberation Army is not coming out. You can only see them only on camera. Those arms that you see they are carrying belong to Nigeria government. They, they, or that arm is only for photo and the video. After they finish, they take it back. Then any time they want to kidnap anybody for money ransom, the government will guide them. Army will escort them. Nigeria army will escort them. And uh, listen now, let me tell you how they operate. Now let me tell you how the Tosia Corps Liberation Army they claim that all of you are falling into thinking that they are they are they are with you in Biafra. They are not with you, they are against you. Look at how they function. If they are going to Anambra, Hopus or Demma, or Joseph Kano, Nelson Wike, and some other politicians and some other Igwe, they will they will request for backup. They will not army now will not come and do roadblock. Let's say they are going to let me use an number as example. Let's say they are going to Oba. I mean, now we now come and lay roadblock that lead to that place. They will pass. They will kidnap whoever they want to pick. They will take, I mean, we open for them. They will take. You know why the army is always giving them backup? So that vigilantes will not have encounter with them. Because other police officers, maybe other security officers that are on, on patrol, may have them encounter with them. Secret will open. So all these ones now we now. So when those ones that are under that don't know the game that is coming, when they are patrolling, this one will stop them until they finish their mission. The money they are collecting, they are using Nigerian army to receive the ransom. They will not distribute the ransom. That's why I tell you the other day, I say, bank is involved now. What is happening in the Southeast? Now, they will not distribute the ransom. The ransom will go through bank. Or two bank they are using, two banking they are using. I don't want to measure the bank. Two banking they are using, two banks they are using. That is cooperating with them. They will go, and Nigeria government have, they give this two bank authority to for that, for Southeast. They will take the money, they will distribute the money according to how they share the ransom. According to how much, it depends how much they collect, they will distribute the money equally. After they distribute the money, I mean, we take their own. Those politicians will take their own. They will use the one that remain, the one that we get to him. They will take it to Finland ambassador representing Nigeria. He says somebody is fighting for Biafra. Why is it Finland is the one delivering? Finland. Nigeria ambassador to Finland. Why is he one delivering the cash to him? And they go and check all the officers who have been the victim of this this shenanigan. It's only Biafran. Either the victim is from Niger Delta, Akwa Ibom, or the victim is from Eboyi, or the victim is from, it must be within the circle of Biafra territory. No Yoruba have died. No Funani soldier have died. No Funani police have died. That is why when I say it, do you remember when I say it at that time in one of my days, I say, no. Victim. That is why they selected that one that happened to Abba. 
recently. They went there and shoot them. That's why they selected a Christian, a Christian army, a Christian army from Middle Belt and sent the demise of those evil officers they killed. Five of them, only one from this thing. They say, okay, since Lion Man want to expose them, they went and picked from Middle Belt and joined those ones. They execute them. Do you remember he take responsibility too? Do all of you remember he also took the responsibility of that one too? <laughs> the woman, the pregnant one that was murdered in Nenugu, he took responsibility. Now, how can a mature Biafran man or woman now we not assume? Okay, now we not assume that this person is fighting for him for Biafra or her for Biafra. Now, let us make a very simple analysis here. You are say you say okay, I'm fighting for Lion Man to give Lion Man a good life, and you turn around to kill me. I am no more. Why the enemy that is saying that Lion Man will not have good life are there? You are seeing the enemy. You left the enemy. You don't go after the enemy. You turn around and kill me. And you turn around, you come to tell my parents and say, ah, I am fighting for you. I am fighting for you people for good life. And Lion Man is no more. You have killed Lion Man. As we are still talking, the one you do. You went to another family within as they are still morning. You go to Facebook I told you. <laughs> they are they want to fly. You see, they want Facebook want to flag down this progress. I hope they did not they will not delete it after this broker. But what I want to do today, I want to give their friends worldwide open eye brokers. Open eye brokers. After today, I will never repeat anything about that guy again. Anybody only tell you the no problem. Now you say you're fighting for me. You kill me. Then other other people who are with me. You are killing them, and these are the people you say you are fighting for. Does that fight make any sense? Is it not the time others we say no? What is this person doing? No, this person is not with us. He's not fighting for us. Look at our enemy. There, go and go, go after them. You say no, and you will come and kill us. You will say hey, you are fighting for us. What kind of fight is that? Which which agitation we are you fighting for? I don't understand. Common. This is very common. Something to calculate can get answer you don't need anybody you don't need me to be explaining this for you i want those ones who think although he's criminal that are following him anyway and if there is any no criminal there that is still say he's still confused i want them to call him and ask him oga funanis are in the bush can't you join can't you do as ipob they do Terrorists that are coming to kidnap in our land, IPOB, ESN are dealing with them in the forest. Terrorists that say we will not farm, that food will not grow in our land, IPOB, ESN are dealing with them in the bush. There is no crisis in the city. Those that live in the, our towns and the cities are the same Biafrans you say you are fighting for them. Why are you going there to cause problems within them? The police you are killing in the city, the army you are killing in the city. Can't you leave them? Let us see. If nobody kill them, whether they will still go around to be killing innocent youth. Do you know what federal government to do? They will kill their own army. They will give him call. 
we have killed, please take responsibility. He will take responsibility. Then the federal government will now release army to go to that particular community and slaughter youth. This is what he has. That is what he signed for. Because Britain and the Funane want to reduce the population of the youth in the east. Do you see the strategy now? So if he doesn't claim the responsibility, there is no need. There is no alarm for pro, uh, provocation because that is rules and regulation of army. There is no alarm for provocation. As far as he have already agreed to take this, they will go ahead and kill their own fellow army. And those army they are killing are also from our land. Those police they are killing is also from our land. And those army they are killing is the people that IPOB is agitating for. Those police they are killing is included on those dear friends that we are agitating for to come out from Nigeria so that we can have a good life, so that themselves can be police in our land. Themselves can, in, can now have the test of what is called policing, enjoy what is called policing work. The army will now enjoy and they have the respect of being an army. Okay, is that you now agitating that if Biafra come tomorrow, the former army officers in Nigeria cannot join uh, Biafra army? No, that is the people that will even join it first. Before now, we now recruit the new youth. Are they not the one that will teach the new youth what is called army? And they are the people. If Funani and Britain say no, we are not going to go through what they call it through referendum to get Biafra and the war break out tomorrow. Who is who have experience experience to face the battle? Is it not those ones our Bia, those Biafrans in Nigeria? <laughs> Do you see why Nigeria and the British have planned to be slaughtering them in our land? The one they want is good, they will send them to our land. They want the other we have told them this i don't know why and some of them when they call when they call you they will tell you we know what is happening but what can we do in nigeria if we resign what can we that's what most of them have to I say you dying is i've seen that the setup now is is uh, is uh, is is undodgeable you can't dodge it then the only way you can dodge this thing is to resign why can't you resign even i have even advised most of them i said okay don't resign. Walk away from army. Take your gun. Form a form a team of five or twenty or fifteen. Find one of these politicians that have bezel money and put in their compound. Invade the com invade the compound. Invade the invade the place. Look, carry away the money, the dollars they put in their house. Anything you see there, you anything you like, they say if you want to keep them alive, keep them alive. Make money with the, the instrument you have. And have a good life with your family. What the most of them we advise, we, 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 we respond to me is say, it's not that easy. Who do you want to form this thing with? Do you know if that person will betray you? Who do you want to discuss this thing with? Do you know that person will? I said, so you have come to. I, I, I even call one. I think one of them told me. I said, so you have come to the point that our Igbo brothers tsunami. So their brain, is it anything that Funani did to them that have taken away their brain? So you people cannot come together again and have a solid plan and execute it very suddenly without any without leakage. You say it's very difficult. And so so, so you, our 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 race have come to this point that they are now informing themselves anyhow. What I say, when did they come to this point? What the man told me he said it's very difficult. You don't know who to discuss with. If you discuss, this thing may leak out and you are gone. I said, what you need to live a good life? Is it the hands of politicians? So why are you bothering yourself? What you need to live a good life is not in the bank. It's not in the importer and the exporter's house. 
and is a, is a, is a, it will be a sin for you to go to meet and a businessman who has suffered all his life to make his money. I said, go and meet the people who have seized the treasure of the nation. They have it abundant. They have it in the bunk room in their, in their house. Some of them keep $2 billion in their house. Some of them keep $5 billion in their house. You form a team, well equipped, invade the house, enter there. If you are going carry van, you enter there, load as much as you want. Carry the money. Carry your family, exit anywhere you want to go. And, and carry their gun and throw on the road. They, they take their gun back. Nigeria, Nigeria will take their property back. Why are you dying? Why have you allowed yourself to be killed in your own father's land? By a few politicians, by micro few politicians, who puts on them of nobody. It's not telling all of you. And one vagabond in Finland is claiming the responsibility in other way to confuse everybody's eyes. In other words, to confuse everybody, to take our eyes away from the reality. I said, don't you see that this is a game? It's a game. And as soon as he do it, he will not include Mazen and the canon name there. And because of the nakedness he has seen with the siblings of Mazen and the canon and Allah the Jimako, all these ones are afraid to come. Now, I want to ask all of you have any family of Mazen and the canon except from his wife? Apart from his wife, have anybody from the family of Mazen and the other Mazen and the Kano sister, either Mazen and the Kano bro, uh, 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 brother, uh, uh, Kano Takano, Mimi, have you seen them come out on media to say, Eberima, we don't know you. We don't know you, our brother don't know you. The only time Maxwell persuaded Mazin and the Kano to speak in court, as a Maxwell mentioned Simon Eba, do you see how our Lord the Jimakon rush immediately? Match Mazin and the Kano leg. Do you see how he matched the man's leg? He matched his leg, bam! Mazin and the Kano slow. He was not in the already, he don't know what is going on, he's inside. So, as he must well put that word in Martin and the Kano mouth. Martin and the Kano wanted to say something. Hello, this is Marco. Oh, where is you? You run and the Kano and hold up. He match Martin and the Kano. Bam! He match his leg. Boom! That word sees from Martin and the Kano mouth. Martin and the Kano think maybe the man is doing him good. Because why he matched that leg for Martin and the Kano to stop that move? Because of if he say it, because that is what that guy is telling them. If you na if you not do anyhow, measure my name. Deny me. Because any day they deny him that is the every day. Nigeria state will cut contract with him. And that is the very day ABI is going to pick him. ABI now will not demand for his arrest in Finland. And that will be his end. He will, he will not go to jail. The jail, that guy will go in Europe. They may condemn him 80 something years imprisonment. That's why I'm, I'm telling you what, I'm tell, what I know. He will go to the jail that he will never come out again until he grow old and die there. Do you see the do you see the, the danger that is facing that guy? And that guy is ready to take many people along with him. He's ready to pack many people, as many he wants. He's ready to pack them along with him. That is why that is nothing anybody that guy caught that he doesn't record. Go and go and 
the day you all of you will know is the day Mazin Nandekano with someone call it. Who is going to tell him now? Nobody will tell him to call his name because they have blocked all the people that are supposed to tell him all these things that I'm saying now. They have blocked them. So that's why I say Mazin Nandekano may die there. Understand me? I'm saying it very open. So let you He may die there. All of you saying he didn't, he didn't do anything. But Nigeria state is playing the game very fine. The very day Mazin Nandekano was entangled and they was tied together with rope, well, that very day, Alode Jimakon went on Channel TV and said that Mas, that's why that question was handed over to that journalist by the experts who planned this game. They handed over to him. Already they have already know. Already know. They have already know the game they are playing. They hand that question over to that journalist and say, ask this lawyer this question. Do you know that that interview, Maxwell is supposed to be in that interview with our Lord. Our Lord by court Maxwell and went on that interview. He betrayed Maxwell and went to that interview. Maxwell only saw that interview on air. When Maxwell said, if you are going, let me know I will go with you. I will be on interview with you. He tell us well, don't worry. I think the channel TV have cancelled that that uh, interview. The next thing Maxwell saw on the interview took place because Maxwell could have been the person that would save Mazen and can. So Alloy informed them after he have received the money. Alloy now informed them that my colleague want to be here, but if he is here, this job will not work. He would, if I say it, maybe the journalist will ask him during his own time, he will debunk it. He may tell him, No, 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 that is a mistake here, uh, my colleague. Uh, uh, Mazen and the kind of followers is not the same as a Belima follower. Uh, my, uh, the man you are saying that is, they have never been an IPOP member before, so how can an IPOP member not be a follower or somebody who is not no, no member of IPOP? That what what Maswell could have said there and that what Maxwell is that is what is boiling in Maxwell today. Maxwell know where things went wrong. Maxwell know. So the person who testified falsely against Mazin and the Kano is Alloy Dejmak. That was the day they see the business. Even the international community, anywhere you go they will tell you but the lawyer representing the man said that the guy who is terrorizing the Nigeria government and killing them, he confirmed that the leader is in support of what he's doing. Are you getting me now? Any office you go, they will bring that interview and say, is it not the legal, legal man representing him? They say, yeah, you will tell them yes. You know, anyone agreed here. And now when the IPOB all have the Afro, all have the Obua, no, we are with them, with them make move. <laughs> Anywhere you go, they will say, no, come. Is it not this man is the current legal representative of this leader? Say yes. Yeah, he can't deny it because he's there. Yes. But see, why are you denying this guy? He said, don't know, but the leader is in support of him. Because imagine the legal practitioner representing you, have entangled you with the suspect. Who will not save you? Nobody. Okay. Even one of the office asks, where is his brothers? to come out and make it open. At least from there, action can be taken and look into the matter of the lawyer. 
why the lawyer have refused to distinguish to distance this man from distinguish this man from this man. Prince Mimi have never openly condemned neither in Twitter, neither in Facebook. If anybody see anywhere such have happened, bring it out for me. I need it. Print it out. Anywhere you see Mimi have come out to condemn the Funani boy in Finland, give me the Twitter, print it out, because I have gone there to check, so that I will use that evidence to go back where I went to office. Go and give me. Print it. I need it. Print it and send it to me through my inbox. I will print it out as well, so that if I go there, I can show the people. I say, no, the brothers have condemned the man. There is no way. So all of you, all of you who are saying, Okay, sorry. He said the man and the fan is disturbing the mic. Sorry. <laughs> so all of you crying, being emotional. That's why I say, forget about emotional. Remove emotional first, Biafra. I pop. I pop have tried their best. face Biafra. What we are facing is Biafra. Not, we are not serving any, any human being. We are facing Biafra. Then, if the family, if the siblings or Mazen Nandekani himself want to join Biafra and enjoy the Biafra we are going to restore, he know how to go about it. The only thing he need is just very simple word that we go on record. Then we can able to take that word and go and meet the offices we meet already. Say, come on, this man was not aware of all these things. Now I think he's aware he has come out to distinguish himself from the nonsense. So what people have to say about it? They, they, those people they come from there work work something out. They come from there, work something out. Imagine that the can will be out. And the killings of the Igbo officers. And this man, Nanakanoki, we, we could have helped. Those only word he speak and deny and distance himself from the man. Our innocent Igbo officers who are serving in Nigeria will stop being killed in the Southeast. Nobody will. The Nigeria state will not have the ability to kill them again. So that the guy will take responsibility. Our youth. Who they always come and slaughter after they have killed the soldiers. Our own, oh no, they will they will still kill our soldiers in our land. They will still kill our youth to join them. At least all these things could have saved all this while. I Lord the Jimako is the now I want to put it to all of you. I Lord the Jimako is the one slaughtering our youth. I Lord the Jimako is the one slaughtering our youth in our own land is the one killing the African youth around the African territory. Our Lord is the one because you know I say is the one. He have access to Mazen Nandekanu. He knows what is going on outside. He knows what is holding Mazen Nandekanu. Only what he need to do there is go there and say, uh, Mazen, I am sorry. Every of involvement, he will confess it to his Mazen Nandekanu. Mazen Nandekanu who know how to handle it. Ah, I made a mistake. Maybe I did not know. I thought that this guy loved you. I thought that this guy was with you, but I never know his enemy. I never know he's working against you. I never know he's working against Biafra. But now I have realized this thing. Please, when you come out in a court, make it public notice so that you will come out from here. This is what is holding you here. Finish. This is what is holding you here. Deny him. So maybe the world that want to pick him up now will now go there and pick him up. Let us see how Nigeria is going to save him. <laughs> Good afternoon. 
You are welcome. Where are you calling from? Look, Canada. Hello? Me? You have to speak loud. You have to speak loud so that the world will hear you. Yeah, but I'm speaking louder. Okay, now we are hearing you now. Before it was cut in. Yeah, um, I'm watching your program. Yeah, yeah um, last time I called in your program and said uh, our, uh, and uh, you know, it is, res I mean, respectfully to correct what as Azariba was saying, that, uh, but that day network, network was bad. Yeah, yeah, but very, very bad. Okay, yeah, our, yeah. Yeah, none, none of our leaders should come up on our platform to say, uh, or either on their own platform, as long as they are our leaders or IPOP official um, media platforms cannot come there and begin to like sound compromised or condescended, like come saying uh, anyone they give us we take uh, if they give us we no we no, we're not doing that. Um, our we cannot we are, we are restoring Biafra. It is up to them what Nigeria want to do in Nigeria. But as for us, it is Biafra. Even when they start saying that, looks like we are not serious. I'm not accusing them of not being. I mean, it, it doesn't. It, it, it wasn't encouraging things such on his platform. He's a leader. We respect him. As I am saying here. Yeah. Again, also that day I was trying to say. Um, this uh, this is how what Nigerian politicians did. Yoruba politicians and slash Nigerian politicians came up during the time of Abiola and begin to rally around. Oh, Abiola is coming out. Yeah, Before yeah. You know, it's something else start to ask. Yeah. These Nigerian politicians, no matter how you look at them, no matter whether they are Igbo or not, they cannot be trusted. Not that we are not acknowledging some of them who are sim uh, sympathizing, but they, they, their power is is just uh, minor. They can't do anything. Igbo man now, or Biafran and, uh, at large, he, he has no strength in Nigerian politics. Exactly. We are, we are beyond my own, we are beyond minority. You now. just so say it the way it is. This. You just say it the way uh -huh. it is. Yes, you just say it the way it is. They have. Yeah. So uh, we don't have any political juggernaut or leadership that you can look up to or say something. They will hear. So all this thing that running around on social media. After who puts the kill our people, they come to say oh, they want the cannon to be released. That thing I see it as jamboree. Our people should not be. God of Nazareth. Go ahead, go ahead. Um, uh, appeal court. No. Appeal court, he won an appeal court. He go to the Supreme Court. Supreme Court acknowledged appeal court. But because it is Nigeria and their uh, marauding or deceiving kind of uh, officiating legalities, they, 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 they manipulated everyone, say, go back to high court. Yeah. It doesn't exist anywhere in legal department. I don't know. So our people should remember that we won our case. The reason I'm mentioning what Azariba said is, is also coming to you. I dis uh, I'm respectfully, my brother. Mm. I want to disagree with you on the area that you said and the kind of made idea. No, we can't say this. It, this might is not demoralizing me because. Uh, uh, my brother, hold on. My brother, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. No, I know. I know. I wait. Let me finish you. Then you answer me. No, no, wait. As you are talking, I have to get you right so that. Let me tell you something. You remember what I said? This is not the time to add emotion on this issue anymore. Like this network is bad again. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, go ahead. It's like, let me wait for you when you finish your answer. Go ahead. Okay, so now this, this thing you're saying here, I know you mean well, five years, but might demoralize some people. Okay, ooh, ooh, ooh. We, we, no matter what Nigeria is, is doing, we can't pay in their own gallery. We cannot follow them. 
we must, our program, our POB program is our POB program. Program in the sense that we have instead of worship, we are under control, under oath. Whatever our leaders say, we follow. If the Nigeria mind is for the kind to gradually pack up in prison, uh, in detention, and uh, you know they make one news or the other, no, now the kind will not pack up in prison. We love him so much. Again, again, IPOP have not started. You said they have tried their best. No, we have not even started. Our no, I am talking at the angle. Goal. I am talking at the angle of making sure that he comes out. Not the not the angle of our restoration project. Our restoration project is ongoing. Uh, it's ongoing. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Okay, now, now, I don't know, I, I, I'm not to your level in IPOB. I'm just supportive of my own. I don't understand is how it is. You know, I know China Samuel all last time said, Nande to the president. But I want to know, is it Nande Kano as it stands today, Nande Kano or IPOB property? Can we not, as say, as say, as an uh, uh, organization, choose who represents and be the matter? Now the colonel was not arrested on personal level; it was on organizational level. Why did we not blaming, not blaming the leadership? What I'm saying is, in case it's an oversight, sometimes we need to go back and like make the research or down, down like this. pieces pieces to pieces or down set everything we have done then begin again so that we know if there's anywhere we have made mistake in my opinion i think we should okay. we should let me follow up that i think case and yeah my I... first final my last sorry my last uh, my last submission then i'll let you talk my last okay and i know that uh, Anybody who you say that is say hey, people put so the can or IP leadership, anybody saying that simply means they don't know how international politics works. The thing is, um, I know that it was Britain who arrested the Nandekan. Yeah. Nigeria as, as, as an interest and the Kenya as a, a collaborator. Yeah. This thing happened is Britain, and that is why they are not doing anything. My question now is. Even though I know that uh, our uh, leaders, uh, brothers, has messed up some case in Britain, can't IPO be officially age a legal um, um, suit in British land? Do we not have the capab that capability? Okay. To, to actually bring Britain to es explain to us what is going on with the Nantikano? In conclusion, in conclusion, when we are saying not the Kano's family, please, uh, no, we all know, but all, we should always remember that not the Kano's family includes his wife. So we need to separate every time with that woman. That woman has stood out to tell you, I am with the leadership of our POP. But he didn't, maybe he didn't, like, maybe he didn't, he didn't begin to listen to us. I say, apart from us and the kind of wife, everybody here has me. I heard that. you say that. Mm -hmm. I heard you say that. Okay, okay. I'm saying, not just you, particular. Okay. Because I'm talking to our POP and other media warriors, our POP um, uh, uh, personal platforms. Okay. I know you are that I listen when you say that, but. They should only, you know, when we come here to talk to you guys, not not necessarily you, but many people listen to you. When they hear our contribution, they go back and they change themselves too. Exactly. They should remember that. They should always make sure they can't kind of siblings or younger brothers or brothers and sisters. The ones is standing out in the support of IPOP in the pursuit of release of Fernando Khan and the restoration of the Afra. Thank you, my brother. We'll continue to listen to you. You can Thank react you. to what you Thank have you to stay alive. If not, then. Uh, let me let me analyze. Since you are watching, it must, it must be more better than that because your line always break. So that you better tell that you watch how I will answer you. I think it's okay. So our brother who just give this call. This call is very very uh, very very good. Um, let me start answering those questions about. 
how Mazen Nandekano, the issue surrendering him of the implication that they have implicated him. Now, in the international community, this is the evidence, I am telling you, this is the evidence standing before him. One, when the British government made a plan with Nigeria and the Kenya to grab him, after they have done that, IPOB, he asked, he said, Mazen Nandikano is the leader of IPOB. IPOB got in touch with the legal team, recognized legal team of IPOB, which is Barrister Ifani Jofor. Till tomorrow, Barrister Ifani Jofor still remains the legal team head of IPOB. Go and make the research. He's there. Nobody has removed him. He is still the IPOB legal team. In the same Barrister Jofor have gone to many places or prison to release IPOB innocent IPOB who were illegally detained in Nigeria. Till tomorrow, he is still releasing. He is still going to handle the case of IPOB. But what he is not handling again, by the personal decision of Mazen Nandekano, are you hearing me now? In Human Rights article, if I am the leader of organization, my organization have every right to give me legal backup. Then I have also the right to reject the legal backup of my organization. Then my organization will not push more for that. They will not leave me. I may say, okay, I don't need my organization legal backup. I need my personal legal backup on my own reason. The only thing my organization will ask is what reason may be behind my decision? What reason may be, be behind my decision? That is the reason why IPOB leadership sent Mazen and the Kano to Nigeria. That is the major reason IPOB leadership sent Mazen and the Kano wife to Nigeria to go and visit the husband and ask the husband some necessary question. Because now, Nobody will take the message to go and ask Mazen Nandekano what is your decision. Because the channel to go and ask this question has been blocked. If you give it to Alloy, the Alloy will not deliver it. Because they have achieved what they wanted to achieve in regards to that. Then IPUB leadership suffered and when he get to, when the Mazen Nandekano get to that place, they wanted to even mess the woman up. Do you understand me? That's why any little contribution anybody, no matter how that bad anybody anybody is, as far as you make a positive contribution, if anything happened to that, we must recognize that positive impact that person had played. It was this if I your bar, this let me so rest in peace. It was this if I your bar. I am not saying if I your bar is a saint in Ibo land. Everybody knows their record. Nobody is baby. Nobody is baby. I know the weakness of Ifan Yoba. Ifan Yoba... Ifan Yoba is... I will take all of you call, but now let me have finish one first before I take another. Ifan Yoba is a guy that everybody knows his record. He has this mentality of defrauding. Everybody knows that. That is his fault. Everybody has one way or another that they know you that this is your weak point. Is that it's a frost? What they, even though everybody says he's a frost, yes, everybody knows. Is it only him is the frost in, in, in Iboland? There are many millions of frosters in Iboland. But that effort he made is, is well to say, ah, you a man, you try. Without the final bad effort, Mazen Nandekano wife couldn't have couldn't have gotten that access of seeing 
to deliver that message. Because how they did that job, they did it that even his wife, they, they don't want his wife to have access. Because that is destruction given by the, them, they self give to DSS. Simply because, but as if I a job for, make it very open and the distance mazin and the canon, disconnect mazin and the canon from the game Nigeria wanted to pay, play with the boy in Finland. That was his offense. Then Alloyd, they paid Alloyd to help them do the job. And Alloyd did that job very perfectly. I congratulate him for that, for being that brave to do that job to walk these people out of the way. He shows that, yes, he is very, very brave in crime. He used Lailai blackmailing they push them out of the way and the people who sent him the job have a handshake with him you're a man but i am telling everybody today that alloyed a job is like a rat biting you and blowing you breeze That is why he refused to work with the leadership of IPOBT tomorrow. Because those ones knows everything. So there is no way he can work with them since they have already know his secret. So he ran away from them. Then in the area of the... Uh, if you, you ask if IPOBT doesn't have the capacity to go to London to open... Uh, Lego, uh, this in action against Britain on what happened to Mazin and the Khan. Did you remember Radio Biafra that Mazin China Samuru once said that they called on Kanon Takano when they noticed he wanted to go and they said this is not the time to apply for this case over there. Wait. Let us finish. We tell you the time to do this. Don't forget that IPOB leadership or DOS have everything it takes. They have lawyers there. They have professional lawyers there. Don't forget they have everything that it takes in this. Every field is there. When it comes to security, they have those who are in army outside Nigeria that knows everything about who study security, who are security experts. When it comes, they will tell you, oh, Okay, let us do it this way. They will, they will, those ones will handle it. Let us do it this way. Let us do it this way. And it will work fine. When it comes for legal issue, they will say, let us do it this way. Let us direct, direct the legal team to, to go and ask for the fire job. He will tell you. When it comes to legal issue, those ones, those departments will come out and say, okay, look at how you will go. Look at how you go. They share ideas together before they take any action. They told Canon Takano is not yet the time to apply for this thing. Remember, in a case, any legal action, do not make mistake initially. If you make mistake, that it will it will take go and ask anybody this thing. Go and ask any professional lawyer this thing. Don't make mistake initially. That's why they say study every case before you enter. Because to make the amendment. It's very difficult. Study it properly before you and that's why some lawyers will tell you let us do this first. Then you wait. You know, I don't know if you if you have if you have communicated with some lawyers that are some certain case you want to fight for. The lawyer will tell you maybe you want this case to quickly get a, a judgment. They will tell you no, leave this case to last for six months. I don't know if you have that experience. Lawyers will tell you, allow this case to last for six months. Maybe you want that case under two months that your arrest happened. They will say, no, if you go now, you make a mistake. This is how this law works. This is how this law works. Allow the case to, to, to get cool. Let the pressure on the case come. Then we will not enter. 
there is a friend of mine that have a very serious case one certain time. The lawyers went there and visited him and said, no. We said, no, get him out. Make sure you get, he said, no. The lawyer come back and said, no. Allow him to stay nine months. <laughs> when the guy here, nine months, he said, hey, I said, I will be in prison for nine months. The lawyer said, that is the only way he will come out. Allow him to stay nine months, then we will not come. I have studied his case. I have sold it. Allow him to stay nine months. Then at the end of the day, the guy said, "No, uh, the lawyer, the lawyer they sent to him is not. He doesn't know anything. He wants him to stay in jail for nine months." He pressurized us. Pressurized that at the end of the day, we went and hired another lawyer. The lawyer go there and study and study and say allow this case to stay my more the same thing that that one said they don't know each other do you know what he did he thought that you we are not serious he went and called his own sister to get him lawyer he go there that one getting lawyer the lawyer studied and told him you have to stay a period of time so that this thing will go down more before we enter he said he want it now, 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 now. If now money, money no be problem. When that lawyer entered there, do you know that that guy spent almost two years? Because that one collected the money. That one just received the money. Because that one know that, yes. When we go back and meet that, that do you know what the lawyer said? For applying that time, he have already messed the case up. That was the lawyer we hired first time. As we go back to the office, say, no, he say he doesn't want to involve himself in that case anymore. That for applying earlier, he have messed the whole thing up. So that was exactly what Kano Takano did. And that is the time they were dodging the OA, they were dodging them, they were hiding, they were boycotting them. Because it was one reason to another. Emana oh my handy bottle will uh on your jaw about some below when you're not here. Oh my hair men who had they're afraid of the US. But that thing had they're afraid of the US. I am very hundred percent sure that that thing is already in the hands of the DOS. So why dodging? Why are you hiding? And that is hiding, that is what they want to buy court and mess, they now mess everything up. Because nothing, you see, there is nothing hidden under this sun, under this heaven. I keep on telling people. It's just like one analysis I made once at a time. Maybe a married man, you went outside and have a affair with any woman. Maybe a woman want to threaten, maybe you have money, maybe your family is very quiet. The woman want to destabilize your family. He not come, he not come to you and tell you, uh, uh, I am pregnant for what we did the other day. And as a married man who want to keep his home very quiet, you now tell the woman, you know I'm married. What, what solution can we do? The woman now tell you, I am not aborting, I am not doing abortion. I am giving birth. Maybe unfortunately that woman may not even be pregnant. Maybe he just want to threaten you. The worst mistake you will do as a married man if you are not brave enough is to release any money for that such woman. Is to release any cash. If you release cash, you, you, you have finished yourself. The best thing as a, as a brave man is to go home, call your wife. The moment you don't talk to her, talk to her, he doesn't... In that, summon courage, call your wife. Honey, sit down. I have a discussion. I have a confession to make. The moment you don't tell woman confession, uh, he heard, her head will stand up like this. Say, Please, I hope you will forgive me. If this is a real confession, I know I have offered, and this confession will touch you. But I want you to forgive. Whatever I want to confess, yeah, forgive me. Baby. Look at what I did that side though. Look at and this is so woman is threatening me. Period. Case have ended. You have saved yourself from stress. If it is a wise woman, what woman will tell you, okay, relax. 
Look at how much, he will tell the man, look at how much this man is demanding from me, and I will not give. This money will help our family. Instead of you, say, if you want to make the thing self even more useful, carry that money he demanded from you and give your wife. Baby, I am giving you this money. Take this money. Hold, hold the money. Let this money that is demanded, and this is the money, hold it. I'm giving you the money. Handle this case. Carry that case of that pregnancy or whatever. Hand, give it to your wife. If a wise woman who wants her home to be secured, the next thing will tell you, honey, relax, don't bother. Allow the woman to come to this house. Yes, allow the woman. I think the woman said he will come to your house. He will come to our house. Don't worry, she's welcome. Allow her to come. If the woman call you again, just tell the woman you can go to my house and meet my wife. If that woman no run. If that woman no run, no come a lion man, the woman will, he will he will run away. He will say, no, which kind of man be this? We make a go meet wife. Facebook, I don't know. They want to flag down this program. The woman will run away. The woman, as soon as you tell the woman, you can go and meet my wife in the house. The woman will run away. He will never come near you again. That the case close. So what they, we are dodging, hiding for IPOB, not to know. I am very sure, hundred percent sure. By now, the leadership is already in their hand. So why dodging? Why messing everything up? And look at where they keep the man. Why is not that have come out since? And this is why this boy. You know, when I told you Biafras earlier about this guy in Finland, I have never seen the kind of... One day I asked myself, I said, what have Mazna the Kano done to this boy? That this guy... You see, you see, some of all these politicians looking at him say he hates, he hates Mazna the Kano. No. The kind of hatred this guy has for Mazna the Kano proved that this guy is a real Funani. Because it's only a fool that will have this kind of hatred on evil man like this. It's only a fool that have this natural hatred on evil. The kind of hatred a man have for Mazen and the and even, even Satan cannot explain it. Those following him know. Those following him, they know that he hates Mazen. Anytime I say this, in those ones, they know. They say, this man is talking, he's saying the truth. Imagine somebody not minding what he's going to face in future. Just because of the hatred, he accepted to be asked to be. Do you know the meaning of somebody or another person kill? Another person is taking responsibility. And whoever takes responsibility is the one that's been indicted for whatever crime. Do you know what you, do you know how many people that do you know how many file FBI is keeping for him? Do you know how many file intelligent international intelligence agency is keeping for him? All this killing going on in, in our land. Both the ones the Nigeria army will come and slaughter, as soon as he claimed the responsibility, they will come and slaughter the youth. All those records are under his head. If you don't know, it's under his head. And the, as soon as Mazen and the colonel and the, the legal team who is representing him now and the siblings of Mazen and the colonel have never come out to disconnect Mazen and the colonel from him, Mazen and the colonel is included. Because who finished the job? Alloyed. On television. I don't know. Can play the voice. Because I'm like, I'm like, when did I watch it? When did Alloyed testify against Mazen and the Khan? I never see him. I go play him now. Not be me. I go find him out from my Facebook. Wait. I'm playing it immediately. 
wait because uh, I don't want to say somebody will say he alleged me no thank God that these days we we are in a digital world whatever you say is there anytime you need it you go there and take it I'll everybody listen to this voice thank you for joining us on news night now let's get something thank you right let's get something uh, really straight here uh, we need some clarity uh, for the purpose of the view okay uh, those enforcing the sit at home wait order, wait wait do you hear what do you have the language the journalists use for clarity so this question was handed over to him by the experts ask this man because there's something they have found out the secret dealing of Alloyd and the Bilima in Finland. So that's why they went and handed this thing, question to this journalist and invite him to come. They want to see with that dealing they have together, he will, if he can have mind to tell the world that no, Martin Narekan does not know this guy. The follower of Martin Narekan can never follow this guy. Already, they have already, those people who handed this question over to this journalist also called that guy in Finland and told him, watch out, if he deny you, expose all of them. Expose both Martin and the kind of siblings, expose the Lloyd on media, then the arrest will be infected immediately. So, Lloyd was on panic here because he know what is waiting for him. If he say, if he deny it, that one will flash the evidence on the on the air. Then our Lord will be in jail by now. Uh, uh, Karen Takano will be in jail by now. Prince Mimi will be in jail. Can go say in the jail. Then Martin Nadekano will be a free man. <laughs> so they are using Martin Nadekano as a scapegoat to block their own jail term. But that jail term is still there. The jail time is waiting for Alloy. The jail time is waiting for Kano Takano. The jail time is waiting for Prince Mimi. But now they want, they now use their brother to block it. That's why Martin Nadekan can never, I am saying it, I know what I'm saying. Can never come out until either himself come outside to say, I don't know this guy. <laughs> Nah. Yeah, yeah. Who are they loyal to? Who are they answerable to? Are they answerable to uh, Unam De Kano or answerable to uh, Epa? Well, um, I'll speak uh, on what I know as of counsel. Uh, that might be limited knowledge. That might be all you need to know and our viewers tonight. Mazin De Kano is the supreme leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. There are no two supreme leaders. And at this moment, there is no deputy leader. They have other leaders lower down the hierarchy of supreme leader and deputy leader. So standing on that, anybody that acts in the name of IPOB, whether the person acted for good or bad or for the ugly, is often attributed uh, to the head of the organization and the fish rose from the head. So now. Unada nuzi English. Umu biafra, una no pan English. Kavo, un kavo rumi ya diibo. Eba na English le nyunu, au le nyemo sofa sun sobu. Are you people, you people understand English? If you don't understand it, anybody who does not understand English, should be open and tell me in this program. Like I'm not understanding this. Can you explain it in Igbo? I can make quite Igbo. Do you hear him? What he said? We be attributed to the leader. Na kizi hosunucho. If anybody that does anything will be attributed to the leader. Who is when Nigeria government was looking for who would be a first witness against Mazinat?
Alacho. Can you also tell him? We be a, he he what he purposely know what he's saying. He said he, he what everybody. I'm, I'm, let, let me go back again. Um, or IPOB. Whether the person acted for good or bad or for the ugly is often attributed uh, to the head of the organization and the fish rust from the head. So man the Cardinal is very concerned about this. He never meant for things to go this awry, to go out of control. So your question is quite relevant. So we he is trying to separate the apples from the oranges here. So that not when somebody goes out there and say, I'm a disciple of Mazin Mandekan and he levies violence on the general public in the name of sit at home, Mandekan gets to take the bad name simply because he's the head of the organization. It's not fair of him. So having considered all this, he needed Mandekan takes the bad name because he is the head of the organization. Now, question I want to ask Bia France is Simon Epa a member of IPOB. He have never been a member of IPOB. So what consign Mazen Nandekan consign somebody who is acting out of the umbrella? You see, this is Lloyd. Unu boya can join an ajuju. Ngobola ga ekwe bia na this platform. Ta mbwa ya question. Ta mamri sia la, ta mamri na, ta mamri na gusisi ya traza. Provide the clarity you talked about to separate the apples from the oranges, and the best way he thought he could do that is to end it once and for all, to start from the very beginning and end the process that is causing the issues. And that process or that event or act that is causing all these issues is this is at home. I met with him on 24th, and he spoke to me along these lines that. He's now left with no option that to take this drastic step. The question is, yes, indeed. The, the, the question is how uh, drastic, really, is this letter to uh, Simon uh, uh, Is there any chance at all that uh, Nandi Kano may have been put under some kind of pressure, you know, to write this letter, you know, you know just to secure uh, his own freedom? And from all indication, it looks like someone is a genie out of the box. Now, do you hear the journalist? For Mazen Nandekano to secure his own freedom. Do you hear him? Do you hear the journalist? So, what is what Mazen Nandekano? But Naguni, eh? Abalang Baruno is gospel. Or when you hear Mazen Nandekano commit no crime, British, no. Only that then when they redition him, they needed somebody to commit crime that they will label on him. And when that person began to commit those crimes, begin to make the step, begin to make the move. But Stephen Ejofo, may God bless you. Uh, Michael Jokome, uh, son, may God bless you, sir. They rally around. And save Mazen, and save the mission of Nigeria government and British government on that. All of, all of you will remember, as soon as Mazen Nanakano was discharged and acquitted, as soon as they won that case, what happened? Uh, Simon Epa began to assault Michael Zokome. He began to assault Baristi uh, Fajajo. That's when the fight began. Begin to insult them on his platform. Kano uh, Takano begin to insult them. Prince Mimi begin to insult them. So all this scenario, all of you are now being calculative and say, ah, what we make? If only Abra Lebre Breaka, if we the case, then the case have been won. What is the fight is all about? All their ugly head. They rise their ugly head against these people. They begin to insult them, begin to blackmail them, begin to insult them, begin to blackmail them. If you, if you see the venom in the faces of these guys, when they are speaking on camera, you will know that something is wrong somewhere. Because they know that the evidence 
that is available, we lead them into jail. So they needed somebody to represent them there. And that person that will represent them is Mazen Nandekan. Because if Mazen Nandekan is free today, all these people that I'm counted will be in jail with a substantial evidence. He has more than that. He has, he has, he has, he has sent there. Oh, who only evidence in can face it? Only a lagan on a jail. I went through all of them like this. I want to tell you, I'm a balaka like this. It's a ta arumer. India, India, chow konya apotali romu. Umunne ya chow ko potato. Mbaya, mbaya on best people. Ya siblings na chow ke potato. Abuzi, abuzi mu alaya man gebu oni me. Abu mu gebu show me. So here I get message banye focus on the Afra. Chua godi the Afra. Umunne ya. Because I'm going to take a good decision. What a good decision that is pinning him down more and more. Baho we praka from organization lawyer. Boom baho koti pia lo mwen. So, I have to go there. I have to go there. If not, sometime, sometime I don't know the why this leadership is so much consigned. About him, I'm saying it. Leave it. Oh, I will demand them more. Mama, I want to do. I want to do help. I want to do something. Restore your good behavior. Let me tell you, Owa, it's your help. Your help, Owa. I'm my boy, Nobula. This is not a time of emotion. Some people say emotion, emotion, emotion. If you do emotion, you lose what you want. You have to be a man once and for all. If you if you apply emotion, you lose your you lose your goal, your goal target, you lose it. Or it's like a, a a man who is playing football team with his son. Maybe your son is in another club. You are in this club. You see opportunity to score goal. And your son is the one is, is bringing the leg. And you know if he hits that ball, that ball will go to, he will enter into the net. He, out of emotion, he said, hey, yeah, this is my, this is my son. Who, you will not take leg away. Your son saved the ball. How are you going to make the club shine? And you know that if, when that club will shine, they will pay you more. Yeah, that your son will still eat from the money. You will still eat from his own. In that moment, you don't need you don't need emotion with your son. You put leg there and make the ball enter. Your son will fall down. If you fall down, you go there. Your son, you go there and tap, you tap him. But the most important thing, the goal have entered. That is a goal. That is the most important thing. You go there and, and carry your son up, hug him. Is your son? But you have achieved what you want to achieve. And the siblings of Mazen and the Nobody hold him. These are the people. And they make him exchange of their crime. If he is if he released, arrest will be made. Allah will be in jail. Karata Khan will be in jail. Please, maybe he will be in jail. Mazen and the will come outside. He will join IPUOB. Then because of evidence IPUOB may have half on what lead them into jail, Mazen Nandekan Kutoku Yal IPUOB Ashon Oyen. Yes, I go no no no. Come. First first our journey. Leave them to face their crime. They know. They know what IBB will do. That's why they are afraid. 
That the crime had committed because they can handle the crime of the international community. Most of them may receive 50 years, most of them may receive 40 years, most of them may receive 80 years. Oh, yeah, man, you had to appear, appear, walk him as you had to eat a bank. You said that you said they had a McQuanian and now come along after the hour. So that is the game. For those of you who have never watched that interview to the end, I won't have time, I won't have opportunity to play the whole this thing. Go there, I posted it, it's there. Go there and watch it. Is there? So most of you stop saying it that uh, don't tell me you have the power to do. I have told you how in the legal uh, uh, this in foundation how it works. If I give you lawyer, you have the right to reject the lawyer and choose the lawyer of your own. And I will not have the right to impose any lawyer on you. So Mazinan can have chosen his own lawyer who is killing him. So if he survived the killing, glory be to God for him. We thank, we dance on the streets for him. If the lawyer succeeded killing him, <laughs> he is a man choice. He made the choice. And what Allah will never do is to allow Mazen and Khan to escape him. Allah will make sure that Mazen and Khan will stay there and go down on it. So that if they want to arrest him for the evidence that is on ground, he will tell them, no, is the man who was in jail who have, God forbid, I said God forbid, but I am using the language very clear. So, so I am using the language very clear. God, I said God forbid, so that if you want to have a message, you will say no. Is that man that died in jail now that committed every crime? Why are you holding me? I wear this, they say, no, that your buzzing had this is lie. And that is, we be this foundation of defending himself. So the only thing they say, Martin and the guy, what are you? Oh, I'm the most easy, you. I'm a I'm a low on a gift. So I pray. Only a plan only you know. Pray, pray. Put him in prayer. That's the only thing we can do. God, open his eye. And I have started that prayer. God, open this innocent my eye to see. Show him something in the dream about this man called Aloy. So that only he goes through. Yeah, all of those are first time. You ask God, show him again. Only who did prayer has said, God, show him again and again and again. Even when revelation I got, you go see, you don't even understand. If God wants to save you, he show you that thing again. Oh my God, one certain time, he show you that thing again. He show you, now you run away from that person. Mazen now the kind of wife have told him. He went to Nigeria. The leadership cut out for everything. He went to Nigeria. He found her, help her inside. He told his husband everything. Can't his wife, can't his wife, can't his wife. Those people, they are capable of killing him, clean her if you don't know anything. 
who provided who provided guiding and the security for her to like, go there and do everything and come back. Is it not this late if I know You don't know how mean these people are. So you can help you know send to my perhaps magazine. people who are this this have never been in detention if you have been in detention you will know that detention is not easy the easiest way to convince you over your wife is when you are in detention somebody who visits you or your sister who visits you or your brother who visit, can easily come there and tell you uh, uh, brother, go and ask if you have any uncle who have been in detention, go and ask him what I'm saying. Cut this video and say, You will say, No, this one have the spirits. And he will begin to look. He said, Oh, he can defend his wife. He said, No, I know my wife. He said, Oh, no, I'm going to let me tell you something about blood. There's something you people are not understanding here. My blood sister, my blood brother, can convince me more than my wife. Except if, if you people are not coming from a family that is very united. Don't forget, your wife is the wife of your brother is a stranger into the household. So who do you believe more? Most of you self, I got a meeting with him at the Mazin and the Kansas, when I took the Unachu to Unaka. He's no human being. His Mazin and the Kansas spirit is a human being like us who have flesh and blood. It's a human being that have flesh and blood. So his resistant, his resistant of believing has a limit. They are the ready. They are padro, they are padro, they are padro, they are padro. Wife go there deliver message. Call do ya ni? I will take a wife for culture and they are going to come and they are So don't mind how. Uh, brother, don't mind how. The most important thing, the woman have done her part. God has seen her heart, he have done her part. And that is only the limit he can go. Great dear friends, you people should go to my world and go and listen to Alloy De Jimako, how he successfully pinned Mazen and the can innocent man down. I will continue mentioning his name. I will continue mentioning his name. The only thing all of you will do, those that have gifts, that have the strength to pray, pray for Mazina. What Mazina the Canada you need is prayer. While IPOB will continue our activities for Biafra freedom. By any day, I am a prayer. I don't know this one. I don't know this one. I don't know him. I don't know this one. I don't know this one. Chicken. The evidence will be there. Then IPO will now will not take the evidence to the authorities where the thing is supposed to go and table it. The authorities will now will not see something to to 
to act. That is how government work. Government does not work without evidence. How will also know me? The worst thing that did to Mazin and happened to Mazin and Khan is the man who testified against him is the one representing him. So systematically he have accepted whatever everything the man testified against him for keeping the man by his side, which means I have accepted. That is the that's what the, the what that's what they told me in one office I went. He have accepted why are you people trying to lie. Your leader have accepted why are you people trying to lie. But this person has never been the member of our organization. He have never, there's no way, way any name like this have been in this organization. Then how come? He's not committing crime. And they are giving somebody that is in another organization. How? <laughs> the only God that saved IPUB family. Eh? Is that this guy have never been an IPB member? Remember what I said that the enemy at the something I posted on my Facebook was and I said the enemy struck earlier. If they have waited a little bit, by now that will not be called agitation again. Because that was the his original mission, that guy in Finland, or Chow Ohe Tribiafra. By now, that will be nothing called Biafra again. Agitation. If go anywhere in the world, I'm, I'm, I'll handcuff like. If they have waited a little bit, because where this thing was going to, if our leader, let's say they waited till 2025 or 2024 that we are, by now, those who brought that guy, in for destabilizing Biafra agitation. By now, those people too could have convinced Mazen Nandi Khan to use him to bring him into IPUB. Mm -hmm. And that is only that they were in a speed, and God did it that way. They were in a hurry to execute their mission. If they could have waited a bit. Those people, they will convince man and they can and say, no, this is the man you need. This is the man you need. You know, DOS shut down the office of deputy. The next thing man and they can could have done, when they have pumped that word, pump and pump and pump and they will bring him, he will not come and take oath. Or he may even tell them that he is not going to take oath. Maybe we tell them that his religion is, uh, is forbidden to take oath. Then those people, they will mount pressure on Mazin and the Khan. Remember, most of them, that time, politicians give them money like $100,000, $50,000, dollars $150,000. So most of them that will be mounting that pressure will be those ones collecting those money from politicians. They, they, will, fla they will be flashing that money to Mazin and the Khan inside IPOP. They will say, okay, imagine somebody now who, who will be donating maybe every six months, he donates $150,000. Then group of them will now come and tell you to use this person as a deputy. Who, who, who bought Mazen and the Kanu well? He will use him. They will, he will turn around and mount pressure on DOS. DOS will not leave that band of uh, no deputy leader. They will, they will not leave the band and they will bring him in. Then, if they strike that time, he will be doing all these things now that he's doing. He will be claiming the responsibility. Do you know what he will do? The members of DOS will resign so that they will not be involved. Are you getting my calculation? I said they struck earlier. Before I tell you that, I have given, that's why I said this broker, I will never do it again. This is last time I will talk about him. I don't need to do that to break. I want to break that back of canon so that everybody will see what is inside. If they could have waited a little bit, then he start claiming responsibility from Nigeria government. As Nigeria kill, he will claim responsibility. The next thing, somebody like Mazdike Dozim, 
Martin Asan, or those ones who don't want their name to stand, they will resign. Even me, I will resign. The next thing I will do immediately, ah, since the deputy leader is the one claiming, no, I come out of the car. Fifi, fifi, fifi. I will delete my Facebook. Delete here immediately. Biafra is over. There are some pastors, some people who are managing companies in abroad who is an IPOB, all of them will resign. Then that is exactly what the Nigeria government wanted. Then the next thing they will do, they will bring Mazen and the Khan out and execute him. They will kill him. Then the next thing they will do, they will call him because that is that the mission for they will call him in other way. They will not allow uh, uh, they will not like for white people to handle the case. They will bring they will tell him, Oh yeah, travel down to Nigeria. He will come to Nigeria. They will arrest him. That is the plan. They will arrest him. When they arrest him, they will put him in jail. He will stay like, like five years or two years or three or three years. Already the money is in account. They have paid him enough. They will not release him. They will roll him into politics, Nigeria politics. That is all. Then Biafra agitation is over. Nobody. They strike too early, and that's why I know I said God is great by allowing these people to strike too early. Himself have said it now. Oh, no, no, but I said I have a lot of too. I realized that I mistake a lot too early. They were in a hot and Henry had the Hori Ahabu 2023 Igbo presidency. Okay, we have presidency in there. Presidency in there, he made mistake. <laughs> All their senses was focusing on the presidency, Igbo presidency. That's why they strike early. Apollo Hebrew Presidency, I will 2027. 20, nah, how can you make her execute many of them? I feel we will be shut down. What destroyed their plan is 2023 Hebrew Presidency, as it was promised to them. And they tell them, this is what you have to give us in return. Bring him to us or kill him for us. We give you a presidency. They are not for one night and they are not for one night. friends and lovers of freedom from me from here. These programs have come to an end. May Chico Kabiama keep on guiding and protecting us. We will get there. We are already there. We are moving. Uh, only that, uh, don't forget what I said. Please and uh, please put Mazina the Canon in prayer. Put Mazina. What you need is prayer. Nobody can do anything again. It's surrendered by enemy of his own. So may God help him. That is my final word for him. May God help him and deliver him. Thank you all for joining me.